Um, I'll do a clap so we can sync them. Whenever you try to leave, things just start hitting all at once, you right. know? And so good things are happening. Like I was telling him, we're almost full on all floors. Oh, wow. But it's just hard to, like, get all my ducks in a row before I leave. Like, the kind of week that would be really stimulating if you weren't leaving on vacation. Mm-hmm. Well, yeah, because you said they're going to be, Lubman's is going to be filled next month? Uh, hopefully, yeah. There's one yeah. office that's kind of on the fence, but everything else, we're going to be down to one office. Hey, maybe I I fill it in. Just kind of. I can't believe you haven't done it yet. Honestly, I can sneak in through our office. <laughs> Jake said that he was going to rent it for bit bloggist. Wait, he right was now. like, we have no business plan, no revenue, but I'm just going to pull gonna... the trigger. Got a fourteen hundred dollar office. You used to advertise for CBD. Dude, that's why every podcast makes money. Really, CBD? Hmm. I want hyper local, uh, you know, sponsorships like bluegrass. This podcast is that'd be awesome podcast. this lunch table we get people to provide lunch for the show oh that would be good actually mm. do a little review yeah we should start doing reviews next time when we get our our stuff together I'll do a little b-roll with like what we're eating it's just sort of like the uh, the, pilot. the pilot the pilot that's yeah. exactly what I was thinking um yeah we're running a uh, 5k tonight <laughs> if it doesn't rain out I'm so nervous. Have fun with that. Oh, uh, you know who's running it also? Who's that? Uh, Robert Wolf. No way. Senior. Oh. Wait, senior? Yeah. Because it's the poker run? Yeah. That's so totally. Good. Yeah, 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 yeah. I, uh, cause he actually had a health a health problem this week, and I was asking Charlene about it, and she was like, oh, yeah, he's fine. He's running that 5K today. Oh, uh, that's beautiful. Uh, which is great. Wait, what does that have to do with poker? I have no idea. It's Levi. like, it's so it's a Levi. poker run. So when you start, you get one card, and then you stop at four different spots along the run, and they give you a card, and then everyone comes back, and you play, I guess, like, Five card poker. I'm not really sure how that works. Hmm. And the we get winner. Back and we play poker. Yeah, well, with your hand. So they randomly give you a card at each stop. So it's a 5K, but there's four stops, you know. And I'm sure it'll stack up, so it's not gonna be that hard. But um, then you all come back with your five cards and you like play each other. And the top like ten people get prizes. That's fun. Mm-hmm. So that's why it's a poker run. But I've never really played five card poker before. I don't know how to play. I've only played hold'em. I played, yeah, Texas Hold'em, and I don't know. I have to be reminded of how to play every time. Every time, time. <laughs> yeah, it's the same. Uh, I well, never had that much fun. Playing poker? I like, uh, I, there's a lot of other games I like better. Yeah. Like, most board games I like better. It's kind of no so. fun when you're not playing for money. Because when you right, play for, right. like, a buck, there's even. Basically no stake. There's, yeah. like, there's a stake. I love there's Blackjack, really strategy. Blackjack, Blackjack, is Blackjack, is that, like, 21? Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, that's more fun to me. Yep. There's, uh, a little, there's more strategy. Not a lot more, but a little bit more. Yeah, poker strategy is just like your face. Mm-hmm. Screw people yeah. ever. Yeah, screw people ever. Hurting your friends and family. Yeah. Do you see this? My phone from the bottom of the elevator shaft? Does it still work? Wow, I got shattered. Dude, but dude, I was I thought it'd be in a million pieces. Yeah. But no, it three went, two it went straight down two stories. Two stories. And must have landed like this. And I mean, <sighs> dude, could be worse. What's the worst way for a phone to land? Probably, okay. right? At an angle, maybe? Like that? Dude, it's got to be screened down. I drop it. Yeah. We should get, uh, at some point, we should have someone who knows science. <laughs> I would love to know the physics behind the science with you. Well, just what is the worst? Because to me, I'm not going to do it with the audio. Uh, to me, this seems like the, the force best. would be more evenly distributed. I think on the other side, though, because you're still hitting that screen. Yeah. I just don't really have a huge understanding of how, like, shattering glass versus not shattering glass works. You get Derek on the show. I'm sure he knows. He might, yeah. But this definitely felt like that. Because it was going but it was through, like, a crack. Like, <laughs> could, could have been way worse. I, again, mm-hmm. that Steve Jobs guy, he knew what he was doing. I wonder if it's, uh, are the internally has everything okay? Yeah. Anything? You just Watch. cut your ear every time you use yeah. it. <laughs> Dude, like Kevin Gates said, I got two phones. Mm-hmm. One for the plug. They both 
Neither of them work very Both well. Both of them <laughs> have, like, the opposite problems, so they don't work together well. That's probably true for Kevin Gates, too, honestly. It probably his burner, at least, does not work very well. Correct. <laughs> what? You don't hear a lot about Kevin Gates anymore. Yeah, I think he, like, went really meta in, like... I've seen him wearing a turban. Maybe that's not meta. That's not the right term, but... It's not meta, but continue. I don't know. Like, uh, he did, like, a Cat Stevens move. Like, oh. changed his name. What would you call that? Became, a. Uh, became more spiritual. Yeah, became more spiritual. Maybe Buddhist. I'm not sure. That's all based off one picture. <laughs> <laughs> it's called reading between the lines. Yeah. I'm good at it. I'm good at reading people. Yeah, he was a big deal, but... Actually, I think he went to jail, too. He, like, punched a girl, or that's, kicked a yeah, girl. That's what he went to jail for. He kicked a girl in, his, in the stands. Uh, which I guess is assault. Maybe that's where he had his reawakening. Spiritual awakening. Mm-hmm. Should we just go and play this game? The soccer game? Look at those baby goals. Oh, there's a little... For you audio oh, listeners. This is actually really fun. We played Maybe. this in Memphis over the summer. Is there a goalie? I guess not. Just when yeah. you get Whoa! Ooh, okay. That was sick. But you don't have to be that great at soccer to be able to play. I mean, these guys clearly are pretty good. Right. Obviously. But you don't have to, like, have a long draw. Well, they're playing 2v... They need one more person. For the audio listeners. <laughs> they're playing Also three, for the visual three listeners, three because they can't see you. Oh. He's got me out of bounds. That guy knew it, too. The guy with sunglasses. <laughs> but, um, yeah, they emailed everyone about the 5K yesterday, and we're like, it's definitely canceled. And I was like, sweet, I'm going to go on a run. Like, da-da-da. And then as soon as I got back from, like... Fairly tough run for me, at least. They were like, "Yeah, it's back on." It's like, oh, shoot, it's gonna be canceled. Sore. You think so? I mean, look for our audio listeners. <laughs> it is, looks like in a Transformers movie when like the aliens are coming. That's, that's fair, you know. I'm gonna dance tomorrow. Are you? Do you run? Uh, yeah, I ran yesterday and the day before. We gotta run together. Yeah, I, I did five on on uh, right. Tuesday. It hurt. I did 5.1, so it's no big deal. Dude, these guys are scoring goals. Off Chattanooga Chase? Uh, is that the is that in October? Uh, end of May. Yep. Oh, end of Wait, May. it's May now. <laughs> yeah, end of this month. You can't say end of May when we're already a third of the way through May. All right. I'm going to say in two weeks. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I'm not is ready. It, is it a 10K? No, it's an 8K. Oh, I could do an 8K. Yeah. What is that, like two miles? <laughs> no. I'm not very good at conversions. <laughs> I signed up for a 50k. Uh, I think it's like five miles. Ten well, miles. Yeah, because it's 10k. Six, yeah. You're right. You're right. So I'm I just gonna run that. five miles every day until the race. That's <laughs> probably a pretty good strategy. Maybe take like one day off before right the before. Car butt. car butt. When I get you back from Portugal, butt. I'll have ten days to train. So if I run five miles for nine Dude, days, you say train. You could you could roll out of bed and run an 8k. I don't know, man. I don't know. Your lungs? My lungs. Your lungs. I hurt. Rip a cig halfway. <laughs> yeah, get them right. Ain't right. You gotta go? Soon, yeah. I got so much to do. Is Derek back? I haven't seen him. I'm still in Seattle. I think he told... I think he gets back today. That's really interesting for the listeners. <laughs> <laughs> we all know Derek. Mm-hmm. You know Derek, right? <laughs> So those people in the room over there, I have uh-huh. to give them a tour of Society of Work today. All Four. of them? Uh, we're going to split them into two groups. Who are they? They are just people, business leaders, uh, organizations. They're just getting a tour of the Edney, like people that haven't been in the Edney building before. I've never been in the Edney building. Yep. The lady that was kind of my hair yesterday was like, I was told her I was a photographer. She's like, who do you work with? I was like, oh, I do stuff with uh, Society of Work. She was like, oh, I've heard about them. They're like, oh, really? They're like the co-working space, right? So you're pretty much... Tabers and Taps, they do great work, and they're very plugged in. They're plugged in. They're very plugged in. Dude, Uh, Matt Pat gets his hair cut at his desk. What? He has just some. Yeah. I don't know. He walked out, and I'm like, what's up, man? He's like, you need a haircut? And I'm like, I'm about to go to a meeting. He's like, oh, okay, because my uh, haircutter just finished up. What? Dang, I'm going to get on that. Yeah. Dude, that's a boss move, especially when you have other people in your office. Yeah. It feels like almost like too boss. La-da-dee, la-da-dee. This guy's never not working, so it makes sense. Yeah, it's probably good for him. 
I would get on your phone. Every, every day, I, I kind of try to show my coworkers who's boss, and I pretend like I'm on a call, and I just say, sell it, sell it. You're worth a swine. I say, buy at eight. Imagine doing that while you're getting here. Yeah. You got to learn some Mandarin Chinese. You hit their, you know? hit their hand, <laughs> yeah, the barber's hand away. <laughs> Let me do it. Then you take it, and you cut your own hair perfectly. <laughs> What, it must be someone from like uh, I could see New City getting into that. New City, all New city. city, all City, oh, New City messages. Get a message while you uh, while you get here, okay? <laughs> That'd be awesome. We'll remove our sins. <laughs> We're just trying to combine the key with this era of, of entrepreneurship is combine as many things as possible. <laughs> and so things that make, don't make logical sense together. Get a fresh cut. You want to put them all together. A sermon. And berate your assistant at the same time. It's an app. Exercise some demons. Exercise demons. It's exercise and exorcism at the same time. Actually, be, yeah, be, that'd be a good because you could spell it exorcism, but like the first half is spelled uh, exercise. exercise. Exorcism. Okay. You run the demons away. You run Dude, away from us. Before you know, we're gonna have an office in the Lovemans. Yeah, seriously. That's what I say at these new, uh, like, happy hour stuff with people that know. They say, like, what do you do? What do you and I say? I work with apps. <laughs> That's not even true, though. Get you by. Yeah, it's not true. But you just say it. Oh, oh shoot. shoot. I lost some tents. Dude, the storm is uh, coming. I think that people are going to want to see this. Is this locked in? Uh, just turn the whole thing. Pick it up. <laughs> so we're about to lose some tents over here. <laughs> How's the framing? Really good. Alright, should we call it a lunch? I think so. I wouldn't call that much of a lunch, but... I didn't eat a thing. I know. I'm stuffed. I, got, I thought I was so full, but I'm actually kind of hungry now. I got gravy swimming in here. Do you have gravy on your... Just give me an ultrasound. Look at biscuits and gravy, bro. That you took a monkey? Yeah. You couldn't resist? Couldn't that's, resist. That's the kind of thing that you go for? Biscuits and gravy? Yeah, loaded. No potatoes? No potatoes on there. Okay. When then, I say loaded, I mean loaded. Okay, okay. Egg, two eggs, biscuits, gravy. It's hard for me to have breakfast without potatoes, potatoes at this point. It's fair. It's a staple for me. It's a carb load. Yeah. Because we're running all of three miles today. All right. You actually want to play some Pong? I'd play some Pong. Okay, I will text you if it's possible, but no promises. If it's popsicle, it's possible. All right.